Gardener's Biaf guy here again. So the question is how do you get bees into your Gardener's Biaf? Well there's a number of ways about going about this. The most simplest way and the way that I've designed it to work is to be able to just merely set it up in the garden. It is then mechanically what you're looking for as well as biologically what they're looking for. Um, I then make a lure that comes with the kit that you spray in the hive and on the hive and that will then attract a passing swarm that swarm will then move in basically what a swarm consists of it's the mother plus a whole lot of daughters the mother and the daughter move in they will then start making comb and once you see bees coming in and going and they're coming in with pollen you'll see the pollen on their legs once you see that happening then you know you have a queen that's laying once they're in and they've been able to stay in for a year they then are pretty much bulletproof. This hive is never opened because um, it doesn't need to be because it's a tree stump. It's like having a forest and in the forest there's a tree with bees in um, that are need to be managed and they are very successful as creatures if left to their own devices. So the next way, method of getting bees is if there's a swarm in a tree that's inaccessible um, and a beekeeper has found it but he can't get to it you can actually place one of these hives in the vicinity again set it up with a biomass in the bottom spray on the lure spray a little bit in the air that'll attract a scouting bee to come over and once they have found it and you find more and more bees arriving they will then just move in um, on their own once they've moved in you can leave them for a couple of days and then move it to another location where you actually want the hive to be. Another option is if it's on a low hanging branch you can cut the branch off. This is if the swarm is on a low hanging branch that is you can cut the branch off, cut all the smaller limbs off and then take the whole swarm as it is and just slide it into the hive and then place the roof on. This causes uh, far less disruption than chasing them into a box and then letting them walk in and then moving the box and then chucking them all into a beehive because um, then they will just be in. Uh, the other option is to then um, take them and do the conventional method of taking them, chucking them in a box, letting all the other bees go into the box, taking the box, chucking all the bees in there and then putting the lid on, uh, which is the least uh, well, less desirable. Um, the method that I do not recommend at all is to actually buy a box of bees, be it a nook um, or whatever. Um, I would not recommend buying bees at all, regardless of what the circumstances, um, to be able to put into one of these. Uh, this is required a little bit of patience. I normally say two weeks to two years, um, give or take. A year or two either way um, but more often than not uh, you get bees within the first year or two if you have any questions please do leave me a message thank you bye